Previously with Peyton. I'm just so excited about this y'all. I hope they don't turn me away when they see my hair. Y'all. And that's how men be like men want what they don't possess themselves. Do y'all want to go or y'all want to stay here with camera? Oh, okay, y'all want to go? Okay, come on. Be sure to get all caught up on the vlogs. If you have not, definitely do so. And let's jump into today's vlog and see what's going on. All right, y'all know that ever since I started vlogging in 2020 that I have been battling with skin issues like I'm a teenager and I'm in my 40s. Ah! I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. I have literally been trying everything and nothing worked until I started using Dermatica. And I want to thank Dermatica for sponsoring today's video. I know the bottle looks small but this actually has enough to last you for 28 days. But not only that, Dermatica does send you two bottles a month. So this lasts you up to 56 days and you have two different formulations. So after I finished the first bottle, I moved up in my dosage and they also send another bottle that, it, that has the dosage increase. And I love that about Dermatica because I've never had that before generally with previous companies I would get the same bottle every month and I wouldn't really see the results that I was looking for so how I use it I've been using Dermatica for a month and a half and I use the short contact method which is basically I don't leave it on as long as you know most people they generally sleep in it I don't I leave it on for an hour I still moisturize and then after an hour I wash it off and then I moisturize and I go to sleep. That's my nighttime regime. So that's what works for me. Um, I feel like my results have changed drastically. I noticed one, I look super younger because of course uh, Retin-A is anti-aging, but also I'm getting less breakouts. So I am still purging because that's normal. You tend to purge. I've only been using Dermatica for a month and a half and you tend to purge for like the first four, three to four months. So that's pretty normal, but I am seeing less breakouts, especially when it comes to hormonal and cystic breakouts around my jawline. I do notice just a youthful glow in my skin. I'm so much more confident in wearing no makeup and just going in with like a little light application of makeup if need be just to cover any acne blemishes. I have seen a drastic change in my skin. I get so so many compliments on my skin and I'm like who, who me so to get started with your skincare journey all you have to do is click my link in the description box below and use my code Peyton to get your first month for $4.99 and 10% off your second month which is usually $29.95 now how I like to use it because I have a big forehead so I like to use two pumps and then I just dot it all over my skin um, and then I just spread it very lightly and gently over the skin. I don't want to be too abrasive or aggressive because this can cause more purging but yeah this is how I like to apply it and like I said I use the short contact method. It is extremely effective and I'm noticing that my skin has a beautiful glow and I just look so much more youthful. So I highly recommend Dramatica, you guys. And thanks again to Dramatica for sponsoring today's video. What you 
get on. Look at that. I know, Karen. This bag looks heavy as hell. Oh my god. This bag is heavy. What you got in there? Oh, uh, my stuff, mom. Let me see, girl. Karen, you got two apples in her. <laughs> Your bonnet. What's this? You could have put this in the suitcase. My goodness. All right, you guys. We are headed to Los Angeles for a girl's trip. A much needed girl's trip. We went on a girl's trip since July. So, none of my life is together. August is done. Everything that needs to be done in August is done. We get some time to relax, relate, and release in LA. And I have a surprise. We are going to a my first YouTube event. This should have been my third, but the second one I declined, and the first one I didn't read my email in time because I was supposed to go to VidCon. So yeah, we're going to a YouTube event. So this is going to be an amazing trip. I get to network with fellow YouTubers as well as meet a lot of um, the people at the YouTube headquarters and get to like rub elbows and shoulders and whatnot. So I'm super so excited. Mm-hmm. Karen wants to go to the Wax Museum again because she loved it so much. So, yeah, a lot of things planned, y'all. Like, it's so much to do in L.A. And I'm surprised that I didn't do it the first time we went because I just didn't know about it. But, oh well. Many, many times. And the scent that I'm wearing today, I smell so good, y'all. I have on... Um, um, Le Labo's Tay Noir 29 Body Lotion layered with Baccarat Rouge 540. I smell amazing. And forgive this lash. My my eyes run in the morning, so the salt from the from, from my tears make my uh, lash extensions stick together. So I gotta brush them. But yeah, I don't think I forgot anything, but we're gonna do a what did I pack when we get to the room. Me and Karen um have to pick up our rental car when we land and then um, we're going to the room to get ready for dinner because we're going to Maestro's tonight on the beach in Malibu. So I'm so excited, y'all. SLS to Beverly Hills it's really nice I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all a tour and then we're gonna go ahead and proceed to start getting ready for dinner because we're having dinner in Malibu tonight and it's 42 minutes away I'm feeling like we gonna be late because we only got like an hour to get ready I gotta do her hair I gotta do my makeup yeah and we're waiting on our bags because they took our bags to another room and in that part of the hotel it's been like some construction going on so we gotta wait till they go to their room and get the bags and bring them our bags and all of the stuff is in our bags so I don't know I'm feeling like I might need to save what I had planned on wearing tonight and wear it tomorrow that way I can just like 
take a shower, throw something on really quick. Not throw something on, but put on what I was going to wear tomorrow night and wear that. I don't know. I don't know. But let's, let's do this room tour. Don't go no one that back calling me splurge. Let me jump right out the curb. Make this man feel like a bird. Spend on the first and the third. This is the outfit. We rushing. It's 42 minutes away, y'all. So, but we cute or whatever. Give him body, yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. This dress was hard as hell to get on. <laughs> okay, we give him body. This is the outfit I have on my YSL purse and the shoes. Major distribution, high popping. Mention me to be the hottest topic. Same place you sing your bitches shopping. So we're still on the water sometimes. We're here at Maestro's Ocean Club. Yes, thank you. My name is Mark, by the way. I'll be his assistant. Okay. Nice to meet you, Mark. So this is real vanilla, baby. I ain't gonna be able to stand up straight in about another hour. Like I felt so guilty. This is real vanilla ice cream. I could taste the lactose. All right, we are back in the room now. Look at these glasses. Those are cute. Feet is singing. My feet is singing. Take, please take me home. Cause I remember. Take, take me home. But the toes cute. <laughs> take me home. Oh yeah, sexy toes. And they ain't ashy. Not today. Not today for Not today. They not ashy today. Not today for dudes. Not today for dudes. Okay, so last night I washed this hair and I let it air dry. I will say that I like this hair blow dry way more than I do air dry. Wow, the flyaways are so much more noticeable when you air dry your hair. When you let it air dry, I let it sit out in the uh, sit out on the patio and air dry. And this dress I got from the Style Warehouse. It's SW underscore label on Instagram. This is a $60 dress, I believe. Now, I will say, as opposed to the other dresses that I have bought from there, because Karen is also wearing a dress from um, Style Warehouse, and their dress was also $60. This dress is worth $60. The material is top notch, okay? If you think you're not going to see me in this dress again, you're wrong. Cause I'm gonna wear it again if I get axed out on a date. But yeah, the little the little tassels are super dirty, so I gotta put it in the uh, the cleaners. Cause I'm not even gonna attempt to wash it in my washing machine. But the quality, like this, is a bandage dress. It snatches you, and it's hard as hell to put on, y'all. Let me tell you, I bust a whole sweat. Put the dress on before you put your makeup on. If you put your makeup on before putting this dress on, 
all of this right here is gonna be full of makeup it's gonna be makeup everywhere i put this i was smart i was like nah you know what this dress is giving it's gonna be a little difficult to put on and pull over your head um I take I, I take this wig on and off at night. It's glueless, so I don't um I haven't glued this this down. Even when I do my if I do baby hairs, I haven't been wearing baby hairs with this wig. I like the fresh relaxer look with this one. So um I didn't have a wig on when I put this dress on, and I didn't put on makeup. I put the makeup and I did my hair afterwards, and I'm going to put a robe on take my makeup off first wash my face real good and then take this wig off and get in the shower because i don't want to ruin it i feel like i will ruin this dress if if i try to put it on before um like taking my makeup off oh i mean if i try to put it on before putting my makeup on try. so i think because i'm not really in love with this hair um in its straight state this time like i did it first of all i rushed through the flat iron when i was flat ironing it this morning so i could actually travel with my hair done this time because i was very close to like saying right here. No. Karen, you are hilarious here put your jewelry up baby you gotta keep up with your nice stuff okay mom i wasn't like super I'm not super happy with this flat iron job. Like, I can flat iron. Like, when it comes to flat ironing, I, 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 I can flat iron. I this thing already. You know, I'm sick and tired of men using love like it's some kind of disease or something. Love should have brought your ass home last night. Love should have brought you home. You home last night. You should have been with me. Should have been right there. Last night. Are you gonna cry for a dude, mom? Hell no, girl. What Tony B say? Gotta hand it to you. Had me there for a while. I was so in love with you, I couldn't see past your smile. Now I smell the coffee. Hey, had a wake up call. And left a, you so pretty. Come give me a hug. And left a message that you just don't care at all. It can't respect me to believe that she knows not me. Tony B said, you can't expect me to believe that she does not mean anything. <laughs> you know, because niggas will tell you that she don't mean shit and they be over there every day. Excuse me? Over there every day, honey. Yeah. Alright, we're going to pull it from the bottom. Okay. Oh, you know what? It's a zipper. I forgot to tell y'all. It's a zipper. I ain't, I ain't, I, I ain't know about the zipper. Chai. Baby, this is a good zipper. Why I put the dress on all the way zipped up? That's why I struggled. Hold on, I might not need your help. Oh, this bed is comfortable. You right. Do I want some pickles? Sure, I have some pickles. Thank you. You always sharing with your mama. These bad knees of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, these bad knees of mine, you know, I, I'm gonna let it shine. Whoa, whoa, this, these bad knees of mine. Oh, well, first, pick a movie first, Mom. Oh, you wanna have a movie night? Yeah. Girl, you know I'm gonna fall asleep on you, but yeah, we can have a movie night, sister girl. And you be want to watch movies that we done watched 30 times. So, of course, I know I ain't missing nothing. You open the pimples? I caught myself trying to pop them two pimples on the side, on this, on my right side of my face. I'm probably going to break out another somewhere along here and somewhere in this area because the bacteria. But I did put on clindamycin to kill the bacteria. But I'll probably still break out again. Um, it is what it is. Ooh. Ooh, these pickles smell good. Mm. 
Mm. I'm pickle salt as hell. Damn, how much salt, salt do you need? Cameron, you be careful. It's 600. Oh my God, I'm far sighted. Wait a minute, wh which one is which? When you can see from far away, but you can't see up close. Oh my, wow, I really can't see that. It's blurry. I think it's, I'm far sighted. We eat this super slow in the um, airport all the time. Uh. That may be true, but it's a lot of salt and sodium in those. Now, you gotta be careful, okay? You gotta be careful now. If, uh, sodium is needed in the body. It is needed in the body. Uh, uh how about that? Um, but twenty-eight percent, six hundred and fifty milligrams of sodium in in a pickle, baby, that's a lot. Far side. Huh? We eat pickles at the airport all the time, mom. We eat pickles at the airport all the time, mom. I know, Karen. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Far sighted, a vision condition in which nearby objects are blurry. Good morning, good morning. Oh, look, you matching with your purse. Yep. Oh, you cute girl. Good morning, y'all. So we getting ready to head to breakfast. I didn't even realize that we had a pool view from our room and it's nice. So we're gonna go down to Nook and have breakfast because Miss Girl don't miss out on her breakfast, okay? She even woke up early this morning. I had plans to go to the gym, but I think I'm gonna go to the gym maybe later on tonight. Or, But I am going to the gym. I, damn, I am going to the gym equinox because i want to like i really want to go to the gym on the beach um and i think that one's in venice beach but yeah i just threw something together it looks really plain because it came out really cute but i threw it together so let me show y'all my outfit okay honey girls this is the outfit of the day so the dress the maxi dress is from skims i also have on my loves everybody collection bra because it just i'm talking about it's so seamless under anything like it don't even look like you got a rob, but you got that nice lift. The two, the scarf is from Sam Moon. I have on my Steve Man Hermes dupes, Chanel sandals, Versace bag, and I also wrapped the other scarf that I had because I love polka dot. I wrapped that one around the handle. So we are really cute for breakfast this morning, honey. We're giving a little Aubrey Hepburn with the with the scarf tied. Are your friends coming, Mom? We give them body, too. Yeah. Uh-uh. And scent of the day is Kama Sutra Body Lotion with um, Love Don't Be Shy, Eau Fresh, um, Vicillion, and a little bit of Baccarat. Just a little bit. Like, three sprays. Real quick. I feel like a flight attendant. Good morning. Yes. I think I'm going to get the uh, avocado toast with oatmeal. She said, you a goddamn lot I ain't mean to say that shit, girl, I was goddamn hot so we let the grill, now we in the goddamn right. But she looking goddamn fine. I wanted a bitch who was down to earth, but she want the goddamn sky. Uh, my problems. Okay, first of all, like, look how cute Karen is. She has on her 1119 activewear set with her um, cream Jordans. Oh, baby, she is fly, okay? But look at this room, y'all. So we were taking pictures in the lobby. And my waitress was like, you want to take pictures in a cool room? And she brought us in this all white room, okay? Like, first of all, when I get my house, I want a room like just like this. So, putting this on my vision board, an all white dining room with the wild to wild curtains, mirrors, a couch in it. Like, this is so freaking cute. So they have another room just like this one, but it's all black. So Kevin wanna take pictures in that one. So we're gonna go in that one. And I just got some really cute pictures. Since Karen wearing like all bay, well all white, kinda like like all cream, she wanna picture in the 
all black room. And I'm wearing all black, so I took a picture in the all white room. Okay, coordinated. Did you get the uh, check? Yeah. Okay, thank you. And this is in SLS. This is like um, right in the Nook restaurant. This is cute. Like, look at this. So this is the all uh, black room. Ooh, baby, 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 Big dog status. I am like, one minute I want to put on makeup, one minute I don't. Skin is skinning with the exception of these two blemishes because I had popped them last night. But this one's all the way flat. This one's all the way flat. So, mmm. Skin is definitely doing so much better. I will say that. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that I don't break out. But I am going to go ahead and change. I really wanted to keep this on because, y'all, when I tell you I literally just threw this together, I actually packed this dress to sleep in. This is a Skims Maxi dress. Um, and I, I like these as house dresses. You know what I'm saying? I have a lot of these that Miss Mary sent. And I like them to wear around the house when I just want to, like, you know what I'm saying? But I threw it on, threw the scarf with it. With the glasses in it, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, oh, this a look. It's giving Morticia old money. But I don't know. I think I want to be colored and vibrant today at the event. So I'm going to go ahead and change because initially that was my outfit of choice was to wear what I'm actually going to put on. So we're about to shower, get ready, do my makeup. I think I'm going to go for like a light, clean girl beat. I've been crying all morning because today is my grandmother's birthday who raised me. Happy birthday, mama. I love you. It's everything in me. I hope that you are so... <sighs> I hope that you are so proud of me. I didn't stop fighting. And I'm not going to stop fighting because you put that fighter in me. I want to say happy birthday to you. To you. Happy birthday to you. I wanna say happy birthday to you, to you. I think when I get a feeling, I'm gonna go a little more fuller just because I lose. Uh, I won't say a good portion, but when the after the first day, I do like I do notice them shed quite a bit, and I lose. A good five on each side so yeah washing my face with my dermalogical daily exfoliant this is what I travel with and wash my face you get a nice good exfoliant exfoliating when I travel because I don't really use this one on at home but I like it because it lathers up and turns into a foam. Two, so it's like two in one. The rice exfoliates, and then the foam cleanses it. Me and Karen gonna have a shopping day later on today when I get back from the event. So, um. Because I really want to go on Rodeo Drive. I've literally never been to Rodeo Drive. And I've always aspired to go shopping on Rodeo Drive. Ever since I watched the movie Pretty Woman. And I know I'm not the only one. Like every time I think of Rodeo Drive. I think of Rodeo Drive baby. When her best friend was like. She was like where do you go shopping? Where do the girls go shopping? And she was like Rodeo Drive baby. And I've always wanted to go shopping on Rodeo Drive. You work on commission, right? Big mistake. Big! Because why y'all treat her like that? That's why I don't believe in white privilege. I believe in class privilege. Because I felt like the only reason they did her like that was because of how she looked when she walked in. And it's all about presentation and first impressions. This is a Janique Janae Cosmetics eyebrow pencil. This is from one of the PayPal's. And y'all know I love y'all products. I put this eyebrow pencil last, on last night and I did it over my foundation and it literally just like glided over. So pigmented. 
literally the perfect color I love the angle see you see that I love these type of eyebrow pencils I really don't like it when it's like a really thin pencil I know a lot of people probably like those but I really don't like those eyebrow pencils because I feel like it's more work like this one is just so thick um you really don't have to do too much and it's because it's angled you get like a nice precise little wing at the end and then you just you know just fill it in in the front and then you take your spoolie and you brush up to kind of ombre the front of the brow and this don't have to be like precise because you're gonna clean it up with your concealer anyway but you just want to like ombre the front Cause you want your darkest part of your eyebrow to be like towards the the end and the wing anyway not the front i used to always get ready in my vlogs but i have not like put makeup on and got ready in my vlogs in so long I was listening to, um, so I've been, I posted like a tribute to my grandma and Miss Karen has been listening to Mama by Boys to Me and I'll repeat all morning. But I'm like so glad she's here with me because the last time I, um, I was in Cancun on my grandma's birthday and, you know, I was by myself and I break down every every year for her birthday I break down but having Cameron here with me definitely helps <sighs> cause death is hard man people don't understand like death is very becoming you don't even really know who you are until you lose somebody that like played a, a huge role in your life you don't really know who you are like I really felt like I found myself um, or at least started looking for myself after I lost my mama I realized that I needed to be a better person um, I was moving a lot out of hurt and resentment not just towards her but like just towards people you know what I'm saying and hurt people hurt people they blowing my phone up boo they blowing it up yeah hurt people hurt people so i really wanted to focus on like healing that part of me that was hurting so much because i don't, I don't want to be a person that hurts somebody that's that's a very miserable um damn i didn't even realize i had this face do i like this or do the, does this break me out i don't want to be a person that hurts people because that's a very miserable aspect um, and I am miserable. So we're gonna go in with Huda. I love Huda. Huda, Huda can't do no wrong to me. And I'm going in with one pump, and we're gonna see what one pump does. Cause like I said, I'm not trying to do like super full coverage. I want to give good clean skin Karen they said somebody got to somebody got shot at a little baby concert in Memphis last night I was like this close to taking her to a little baby concert in Memphis and then I got this got shot? um invite to the you know, to the YouTube event and I'm so glad cuz man who got time for this cream lip gloss And dab it in the middle. All right, let's get dressed. All done. And I look so cute. It's a dainty look. It's like a, 
modern day oh my look this bitch wanna argue I ain't doing no debating see no way go past this light then at the next one then turn right Hey you guys, we are here. I'm here with Hi, Lauren. Your channel. Hello, I'm Lauren Lipman. Hi, friends. <laughs> and I'm gonna plug everything. Okay. Is, is Lauren Lipman just Lauren like L I P M A N. Okay. <laughs> You're so sweet. We met in the parking lot. She's a doll. Thank you. <laughs> you are. Sorry. Okay, we are about to get ready to go to the wax museum. So I changed into these Tory Burch loafers. They make my feet look long as hell, but they're so cute, especially with this outfit. I actually should have wore this because, baby, my feet are crying, okay? Oh my god, I have so much to tell y'all. I networked with some amazing people. I met some YouTube execs learned a lot talked about mental health if y'all did not know but there is a mental health support team that works with youtube and just i just feel like this was god saying because y'all know i've been talking about quitting youtube um and knowing that we have this support um really just makes me more comfortable um especially like knowing that youtube is cracking down on a lot of the um trolling outlets so yeah with that being said mm, that's all i'll say about that coming back right? yep Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, honey, we about to go in the wax museum, have some fun, take some pictures, Miss Girl. And I am like seven minutes left on this SD card, so we're gonna have to pop over to Target and get another SD card because I only brought two, and the other one is full of footage that I haven't edited yet. So yeah i'm not gonna take y'all in with us this time because we already have a la vlog with um the wax museum footage but i'll pick y'all back up when we come out and do other fun stuff tonight okay see you in a bit i got a whole corn coming i can't wait to come <laughs> i can't wait to go home and put on the corn removal baby because i use those yes i do i sure do my whole, my whole pinky told my miss. Look, ooh, look at my, look at my little pinky. Ooh, she's so pink. Oh we. Man, cause you don't get much light in here without opening it. I like, I like how the bathroom. I ain't gonna show y'all cause our room look a mess. Okay, I'm not gonna show y'all. But I like how this little sliding door opens up and you can like see inside of the bathroom. It's so cute. So I am about to derobe, wash this makeup off my face, take a shower, put my PJs on, and me and Karen fit to uh, find a movie to watch. And I'm going to edit a little bit because I need to clear out the SD card. Oh yes, yeah, okay, it's in, it's in my Patasha bag. Yeah, I need to clear out an SD card because I need another SD card. This one has five minutes left worth of footage that I can use, and then after that, it's gonna be full, and we still have three two and a half full days of la okay so yeah i can't not not vlog like what kind of travel vlog would this be mom can you pick a movie to watch please mom <laughs> you're so cute you're the cutest if anybody tells you that you're not the cutest you tell them that your mama said use a lie but we winding on down because we gonna wake up in the morning and go get breakfast and then we going to the hollywood sign and i'm getting a body sculpting massage from um this med spa are oh, you gonna go with me yeah <laughs> okay baby okay you can ride out with your mama i definitely want to go work out in the morning so we going to the gym maybe do some yoga i don't know Walk on a treadmill. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm going to put you to work. I'm going to put you to work. Um, but the event today, y'all, it was so amazing. I got to meet a lot of creators. I got to meet a lot of the YouTube executives. Hi, Lana. Um, Lana is that girl. And when she came up to me and she was like, oh, my God, I watch your videos. I love your videos. I'm like, who, me? Because, y'all, yeah, sometimes I be feeling like the underdog when it comes to lifestyle vlogging. Like, I don't feel like YouTube executives watch my videos. Um, so to find out that like one of the girls at youtube at the youtube headquarters watches my videos it just made me feel like so good and encouraging this trip has just been super encouraging um like i said earlier today just to like find out that youtube has a mental health support team um and just find out about more opportunities to like you know rub elbow elbows and shoulders with content creators who um you know discuss mental health and stuff like that because i didn't think that that was like a sector on youtube but it is um and i don't think it's talked about enough because we always like kind of act like we're not bothered by the things that you know trigger us and happen to us as far as like being content creators but like the negativity the trolls all of that plays a role in our mental health you know what i'm saying so to find us something to watch on netflix and i need to clear out one of my sd cards so i can have footage for tomorrow and the following day so i might do a little editing tonight i don't know like i really don't want to work on this trip because it's a vacation for me so
all right good morning we are getting ready to go get breakfast we're all dressed after breakfast we are gonna go and see the hollywood sign again because Kyron wants to do that um and then i had plans to go to the gym um but we might have to hmm i don't know push that because it's already about it's gonna be like 11 oh do y'all notice the glow hmm skincare routine i'll show it to you later on today i had to revert back to my um dmk yeah holy grail holy grail um but yeah i don't feel like we're gonna be able to do the gym today just because like that would require me to shower afterwards and then i have an appointment at 145 then we're going to the beach then we have a movie night later on, on at the park so i don't know i feel like that's pushing it but let me show y'all today's um little cute outfit okay so this is today's outfit this is an aloe set that i picked up from my gym equinox it's just a cute tennis skirt. so so cute and um the matching sports bra and then i just have on this um top from zara and i'm also wearing my tory birch loafers with this so so cute and my chanel slides um i think i'm gonna put on a watch but i'm not gonna do like a, a lot of jewelry so this is the full outfit ain't this cute <laughs> um I was about to say that you get your uh, Apple Watch. She's gonna have the same thing she had yesterday. So the American breakfast with mm -hmm. scrambled, right? Scrambled, nothing on it. Bacon. You want cranberry juice or orange juice? You want orange juice today? And I will take her coffee. I'm just gonna take the coffee as it is this time. Yep. And then. What about the toast? Was it croissants yesterday? I can't remember. Yeah, she had croissants. So I'm going to do it the same way. I'm going to have the, the American Classic too, except for I want my eggs over medium. It comes with breakfast potatoes. It does? Yeah, okay. Yeah, and I want the chicken sausage. No, you don't got to pay this time. I'm going to pay this time. Or do you want to pay? I'll pay. But I appreciate you paying for breakfast yesterday. So I was just on the elevator and the people on the elevator was like, what are you wearing? You smell so good. And it was kind of embarrassing because it's like four different things. <laughs> Today I put on, um, I'm wearing the Kama Sutra Body Lotion by Skin Potion. That's the base. And I feel like that's what I smell out of everything that I have on. That's what I smell. I also have on BDK's Pasta Soir Extra Eats, Baccarat Rouge 540, as well as, I mean, because you're staring so hard. And um, love don't be shy, Killian O Fresh. So I smell what I smell. I smell the love don't be shy and um, the Kama Sutra. I don't really smell the Baccarat or the BDK. I sprayed the BDK right here, but I smell the the Kama Sutra. So I think that's what people are smelling because every time I put on Kama Sutra, I always get com compliments. And I feel like this what projects the most. And it's the body lotion. Y'all. You don't even need to put on perfume. If you have Kama Sutra body lotion or the body oil. Baby, you don't even need to put on perfume. And I know that the body oil is a bestseller. But if it's sold out, get the body lotion. The body lotion is so potent, y'all. I promise you. I promise you. You're going to get compliment after compliment after compliment. Every time I wear Kama Sutra, somebody tell me I smell good. Every single time. <laughs> Enjoy. Okay, we are out here in Lake Hollywood Park. 
I feel like if you want like good shots of the Hollywood sign, this is like the best location to come to Lake Hollywood Park. Um, so we just like brought our towels and we having like a little picnic with no food. But they have like fruit over there and stuff like that. But me and Cameron just ate anyway, so um, it feels amazing out here. So we about to take us some pictures. Um, sunbathe a little bit and then we're gonna head back to the city cuz I have a body sculpting massage but right now we just relaxing and taking some cute taking some cute pictures it's a no drone zone damn man I wanted to get some drone footage like I wanted to get like real close up to the Hollywood sign and get some drone man, I, 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 that's my thing like why sell drones if every time you go somewhere it's a no drone zone like damn Why they don't have Why they don't have something on the damn door? She about it, she show her penny. She about it, she show her All right, y'all, I'm about to go ahead and de-robe. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to get any footage of this, but it's called the Miracle Sculpt. So, hopefully she can make she can make some of this um, fibrosis go away. But yeah, we about to strip on down and get started. She's shaking like jelly. Honey, Benz is Chanel. But I'm still shaking ass in a deli. With my bitch getting daddy. He like him already. He want the walk, but I just want the Freddy. And I'm back in his partner, I'm petty. Call me that B while he eating my honey. You know niggas love bitches with money. I get a lot. Take a spot. If you ain't cooking, then get off the pot. My name Ice, but I always stay hot. Passenger princess, he passed me his lock. Baddest little bitch from my block. Okay, all done at Skinnick and y'all. Samantha is so good. LDMs, which is a lymphatic drainage massage LDMs are so good I feel like I like LDMs more than deep tissue because I just feel like that's what I that's what my body needs it needs like all of my lymph nodes need to be drained and you know you got a good LDM if you go to if you pee afterwards because I peed before she started and then I peed again like right when she was done so if you don't pee after you get a lymphatic drainage massage then they didn't do good but I mean you could tell like she is very passionate about her job if y'all are in Los Angeles it is costly but it is so worth it if y'all are in Los Angeles definitely come to Skinnick and ask for Samantha to do your LDM y'all I promise you you will not regret it and she told me that I should do M-Tone for my fibrosis with in conjunction with these type of massages it will literally melt away my fibrosis so when we get back to Dallas I'm going to be heading back to Vitality C Spa to like look into getting M Town because I know they have it. We talked about the M Town on my face, but um, they also do it on the body. It's very, very costly, but I'll do anything to get rid of this fibrosis because listen, I'm sick of it. Okay, so now we're headed to the beach. Yeah. We're getting ready to do uh, hydro biking and it looks so fun. I brought my GoPro and I bought my little chest strap for my GoPro, but I forgot to bring the pin that sticks into my GoPro that connects to the straps. I'm like, Ugh! and I don't even think I'm close enough to the hotel to go back and get it. Um, we already kind of running late, but I just called them and let them know that I'm running late. So they pushed our appointment to 430, which is going to put us behind for the movie um, in the park. But I mean, Harry Potter is like, what, two, three hour movie? So I don't even mind getting to Harry Potter late because I really wanted to see Dirty Dancing in the, mo in the park. But um, Karen wanted to see Harry Potter, so I already know like... We could be we could be a little late for Harry Potter. I, I ain't even messed up about it because the sun they is. They got snacks there, mom. Uh huh. They got snacks, <laughs> and the sun is still gonna be very out and popping when when the movie starts. So honestly, I kind of want to get there a little late because I don't really see how we're going to be able to see the screen if the sun is so bright because the sun doesn't set here until seven fifteen anyway. So. We should have got a later movie. We'll look into it when we get there. But yeah, headed to the beach. I did, I did. In three quarters of a mile, arrive at 164 North Marina Drive.
Yeah. Awesome. Sorry, it was uh, hard finding parking. It's it busy out here. Correct. All right, guys, we are getting ready. We are here in Long Beach and we're getting ready to water bike for the first time. Calvin, are you excited? Yeah. You look so cute. Kind of dressed alike, just a little bit. Let's go straight across. There you go. It's a workout, huh? Yeah. <laughs> this is so cool. Yeah. How are you tired? No. You sound like you're tired. Cardio, you need this. That's why I said you gotta get in the gym. See, I've been working on my legs. Follow me. Miss girl is getting very annoyed with me. Okay, she didn't. <laughs> It's giving, it's giving I didn't want to do this. It's giving my mom is more adventurous than I am. Pretty much. There she come. Yeah, get that workout on. Get that workout on. Get that workout on. Work that wheel. Work that wheel. Work that wheel, work that wheel. Ready? Mom, it's a workout. Yeah, it's a workout. Wanna take a little break? Yeah. Okay, let's stay together. Let's stick together. I want you to rock the boat, rock the boat, mm -hmm. hey, work it in the middle, change positions on me, change, stroke it baby, yeah, stroke it for me, stroke it for me. Almost there. because Long Beach Fires, we are from LA and we got we was getting hungry baby. First of all, it was a whole workout. One to go. Camera damn just started crying, y'all. I had the pep talk cut through it. I gotta get that baby in the gym because her little legs gave out. She was like, Mom, please. Come get me in the middle of the ocean. I'm like, okay, hey, man. So we getting us some pizza and salad. 
we running behind for the movie. I'm not sure where the movie located. I need to look and see where the movie located. Okay, so we have the pepperoni. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Can I get you anything else today? Some more bread. Yeah. I don't know where the movie is located, but whenever we're done eating, we'll head over to the movie. Yeah. I want to say Harry Potter is like two, three hours, so. All right, y'all. I think I got some good news. I just looked on the tickets. Well, I just looked at the event and it said the film's in asterisks, like a disclaimer. The film starts at 8 30. So, so I think we're gonna be there, we're gonna make it. So, I think we'll be able to make it on time because it's like getting ready to be seven, it's like six something now, and yeah, it's getting ready to be seven o'clock. It shouldn't take us that long to get there. Where is it? Hold on. Let me see where it is. Yeah, I think I think the film starts at 830. So we will be there on time. I'd like to make an announcement. This castle will not only be your home this year, but home to some very special guests as well. Me. I don't know why, but he was going to use this man to get to me. What I mean, it was only a dream. Let that right? calm down. Yeah, they almost should calm down. It's just a dream. Okay. Gary, if he doesn't want to have your name rising from that goblet, it's not just coincidence. It's all horses and the same thing no more. What are you saying? I'm saying no the devils are inside the wall. Tiko Kakarov. He was a dead man. Oh, 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 oh,
the sound was like movie theater sound it was really really good no bugs the breeze was nice it like i don't even understand how it wasn't dark outside because it was like 9 10 o'clock at night and it was still like i don't know like the sky just had this sun just sit type of vibe it was so beautiful like it's perfect for a date night perfect for a date night so romantic like i mean you just can't go wrong if you're looking for something to do in la on a date night that is it the water boats let me tell you if you don't got no leg muscles baby don't do the water don't do the water bikes because miss ma'am miss girl the way she started crying like i'm like karen see that's why you gotta go to the gym with me because see i've been working on my legs so it wasn't that hard for me but yes it is a very much workout like if you have not been on a bike or cycling don't do it baby because it's 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 not for you you are going to struggle okay you're gonna struggle against the current okay but it's so much fun if you if you got some leg muscles if you got some leg muscles it's so much fun what else did we do do today oh and the massage was amazing so yeah today was an eventful day uh, i'll talk to y'all more after i get out of the shower but let me like wash today's day away charge my phone because my phone has been dead um i posted a picture today but like i don't know one it was two different hues like the picture that i posted today and the picture that i posted yesterday side by side they just don't look good together so i feel like i need to post another picture in between it so it can separate the two because like it literally was two different colors and i was trying to color correct it before i posted it but like once i posted it and like looked at it on like my profile i was like ah that picture don't go and i love my dress i love my outfit so i'm trying to figure out how i want to do it maybe i'll just throw it in like a memories from la um you know what i'm saying like collage of like the things that we did maybe i'll do that because I don't know that picture just didn't go on the profile and not like i want my timeline to be or my profile to be like super aesthetic but i just feel like when it comes to like colors not the colors that i have on but the colors of the picture you know what i'm saying like the um the hue the, it, it makes a difference you feel what i'm saying but yeah can i be in the bathroom i am thirsty god i want something to drink that was a good ass shower. I'm gonna wait five minutes and then I'm gonna put my tretinoin on. I've been doing my clindamycin and um, my elastin. I've been doing it since I got here. And it's clearing up. Like when I got here, when I landed, these were two pimples that were at the head. They have already scabbed over and they're ready to fall off. We're, we love that. We love that. We love a good old skin clearing up while we out of out of the state. <laughs> Cause you know, when we get back, it's gonna be some shit. But y'all guess what I did while I was in the shower? <laughs> guess what I did? Girl, I finished Sister Girl. You know I ain't finished you know, Sister Girl was a freestyle. I finished it. Y'all wanna hear it? Okay, I'd like to hear you go. <sighs> me, 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 me. <clears throat> Sister girl. Sister girl. It's about that time to get jiggy. Sister girl. Sister girl. It's gonna be a good day. Sweep the sidewalk, let your side talk, bust it down open wide, and the air feels so pretty. Get jiggy. Let your next move be your best move. Pack your bags, we outside. Ain't a hating hoe got motion this way. Hey, sister girl. That shit, that shit bumping. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a whole music artist. I'm a music I'm a musician. But for real though, I lathered up like five times in a shower. 
I don't know how many times y'all lather up, but I lather up a whole bunch of times because I just, I love smelling like my soap. And I've been using the um, Vintage Suede Cremo, which smells exactly like Tom Ford Ombre Leather. I don't even know why it's called Vintage Suede because it smells like Tom Ford's Ombre Leather. It smells so good, y'all. I've been looking for it. I've been on a hunt because it's hard to find. I don't even, I can't even remember where I found that one. I want to say Target. I want to say Target, but yeah, I've been using that one. That's the one I packed for this trip, and wow. Wow. Smells so good. So I followed this page on Instagram called Wealth. That That's the name of the Instagram page, Wealth. And they posted, Apple lost $200 billion in two days after reports of iPhone ban in China. First of all, what's the T, China? Why y'all banning the iPhone? what's going on what's what y'all know that we don't know because it's obviously something that y'all know that we don't um earn your leisure oh damn i said it was wealth it's earn your leisure posted this in a significant downturn apple's market value has diminished by 200 billion in the span of two days this decline is connected to emerging reports surrounding a potential ban on iPhone sales in China, a critical market for the tech giant. Shit, don't they make them? The news has evidently caused unrest among investors, resulting in a sell-off that negatively impacts Apple's stock value. While the exact ramifications of such a ban are not clear at the moment, the market's reaction reflects concerns over the substantial role the Chinese market plays in Apple's revenue stream. As Apple and relevant stakeholders navigate this challenging period, market watchers and consumers alike are keen to see how the situation evolves and what steps the company might take to mitigate potential adverse effects on its business operations and broader market position. It is advised to keep an eye on credible news sources for the most current updates on the situation. Check out that code switch. Yeah, I'm I'm intrigued to find out more about this because I mean I already know some going on with this damn phone cuz listen, I can't even think of shit without it popping up on YouTube in Google like what's T I'm talking about you all in my head now I know you listening but how do you know what I'm thinking that's what I'm that's what I'm trying to understand that's what I'm trying to understand and I still don't like how Siri responds to me listen hey Siri uh-huh Let me tell y'all, I spent an hour trying to figure out how to make her respond to me properly because I don't like it. I don't like it. Bitch, you supposed to be saying, yes, ma'am. Who run you? Okay? I, 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 I spent an hour trying to figure out how to change that. There is no way to change it. She just tired of us. That's just it. So if you say, hey, Siri, after she say, uh-huh, she just go to back to sleep. Like, okay, bitch, you don't want nothing. Like, what's what's that about? Take up some space. Y'all too far away. Make a leap. Make no mistake. I think you should stay. Okay, so this is today's outfit. So this little set is from Commence Official. I'm wearing my Burberry bag. I got this scarf that I'm also going to like tie around my hair when we go on the sailboat. But I got this star scarf from Sam Moon. It has like um that Burberry print detail in it. I thought it would match really cute. And then I also have on um, my Steve Madden Hermes dupes. Y'all forgive the room. We didn't unpack and I'm wearing my Balenciaga cat eye sunnies. 
So all I have to do is put on perfume and jewelry and we'll be ready to go make sneakers. For jewelry today, I'm gonna keep it simple and I'm just gonna put on the Fendi ring, Fendi bracelet, and my JBW watch. For perfume today, we're wearing the House of Oud, um, Bon Bon Pop. Smells so good. Oh, this, ooh, this is so good. You want a little oil on your legs? No. Did you put lotion on? Yeah. No, you didn't. Going down. And look at Miss Karen. This girl didn't want to get up this morning, so it's giving a little cranky. Thank you. My pleasure. Safe travel. I also brought my Versace bag so I could put out my stuff in it, like my drones and stuff. So we can get some footage. Damn, I smell good. Hello, good morning. Nice to meet you, Matt Adam. Hi, good morning. Uh, the Mustang. The Mustang. Thank you. You too. Okay. Oh. Did you want to try them on before you start yes. this again? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Okay. So start off by taking off your shoelaces and acetoning it. Okay. That way in case you want to paint. Back to get wrecked. All respect to those who break their neck to keep their hopes in check. Cause no big sweat a brother majorly. And I don't know why your girl keeps paging me. She tell me that she needs me. Cries when she leaves me. And every time she sees me, she squeeze me. Lady, take it easy. It sounds sleazy, but tease me. I don't want it if it's that easy. Hey, yo, plus it. Baby, got a problem saying bye bye. Just another hazard of a fly guy. Your ass why it don't matter. My pockets got fatter. Now everybody's looking for the ladder. And ain't no meeting being greedy. If you want to see me, gotta keep a number, baby, when you need me. And I'll be there in a jiffy. Don't be picky, just be happy with this quickie. When will you learn? You can't time it down, baby, though. Check it out. Let them hoes know. Now you can tell from my everyday fits. I ain't rich, so seats and this is with them tricks. I'm just another black man caught up in the mix. Trying to make a dollar out of 15 cents. Just cause I'm a freak don't mean that we can hit the sheets. Maybe I can see that you don't recognize me. I'm Shock G, the one who put the satin on your panties. Never knew a hooker that could share me. I guess What's up, love? How you doing? Right. Well, I've been hanging, singing, trying to do my thing. Oh, you heard that I was banging. Your whole girl you went to school with. That's cool, but then she take your bottle sister and your cousin thought I wasn't. Uh. See, weekends was made for Michelob, but it's a Monday, my day. So just let me hit it, yo. And don't mistake my statement for a clown. We can keep it on the down low, long as you know that I get around. <laughs> All right, we are all done. We got our shoes. They came out. Calvin's shoes came out so cute. She got this cartoon type of thing. Her shoes are so, so dope. And then I did like an ostrich shoe with like the gray because I really want to wear mine. And I got like this gray at home. But I got an outfit. I don't know. I got an outfit in mine for them, So. Okay, we about to get something to eat and then head over to Long Beach, back to Long Beach to get, um, 
to get on a sailboat we're doing a sailboat we're riding on a sailboat so it's gonna be super super cute oh my god this sea hot as hell Ooh, burnt my butt y'all y'all gotta do that they're talking about having pop-ups in dallas but um every time i've seen them i've only seen these uh advertised for in la but i think the event is like mm, i'll put it up here on the screen i think it's a hundred and something and then if you don't bring your own shoes uh the shoes are like a hundred and something too because it came out to be like 260 for two pairs of air force ones Bro, um hot. i told you it was hot oh, um please. Let me see. I'm gonna cool the seats. Sit on down, Karen. She's so dramatic. Um, but yeah, it's a perfect day date situation as well. Y'all know I'm always trying to give y'all like date ideas i don't be going on dates girl but like i know y'all be going on dates because y'all like real pretty and cute and stuff and guys be asking y'all out on dates but like i don't be going on dates so really cute date situation um very creative like get your creative juices going i really didn't know what i was gonna do and then i was like i think i want to do like an ostrich because i really wanted to make some blue jean air force ones but they didn't have the blue jean fabric so i was like okay let me do like this gray and neutral kind of thing and then when i tried them on they actually go with my outfit so i could have put them on but like we about to go to the sailboat and i just want to give it like old money vibes on the sailboat all right so next up we about to go get us something to eat and i don't know where we could like get us something to eat out in long beach because that whole little area is a vibe and has a lot of nice restaurants but i'm kind of hungry right right now so we about to see what's in this area because we are in glendale like 43 minutes away from um come on skin my skin is looking so pretty today um 43 minutes away from long beach so we fit ahead to long beach and then um i don't know maybe we'll eat maybe we'll head to long beach and then eat when we get there because the sailboat um isn't until five the sun gonna be out and popping i ain't bring no sunscreen sister girl didn't either but we are gonna put our scarves on so so we're at um four cafe cafe four karen's getting a vegan burrito bowl and i'm gonna get a mahi burrito bowl a fish burrito bowl and i'm drinking a cucumber mocktail and it is amazing what is, what's your mint lemonade taste like That food was so good, wasn't it? Cameron ate all her food, baby. She murdered that burrito bowl. That tofu was so good. I should've got that one. But the mahi, the mahi fish bowl, burrito bowl was good too. But so my mama, she joked about that chair. Yeah. And she was the running off inside of me. <laughs> Y'all, a bug was trying to kill me. That shit was funny. I wish I had got it on camera. A bug was literally trying to take my life. All right, we headed to Long Beach for the boat ride. You ready, sister girl? Yep, I'm ready. Nice that it's only two of you guys. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. Tell it. Gotcha. Charisma, integrity. Gotcha.
potatoes and sausage I was like okay miss girl it's a black owned spot it's called Louisiana Charlie's right here in Long Beach the captain on the boat our captain he recommended this place he said he eat here all the time and he specifically said it's black owned he was like it's really really good I'm like okay You smell so good, you put on bakara today, huh? Yeah. Smell good on you. For the bread. Damn, it's <clears throat> all this spice messing with my uh, acid reflux. Man, I wanted to get some drone footage, and as soon as I took off, the damn battery low started going off. I'm like, it takes so long. The the remote don't take that long to charge up, mm -hmm. but the drone. Mine it takes forever to charge up, so I'm gonna have to put it on the charger tonight and get some footage in the morning. But I really wanted to get some footage of us on the beach. So before we get on the plane, we need to find us a beach somewhere and go on the beach and walk on the beach because I wanna get us on the beach. I'm on the beach. Gotta start from the forehead, Kara. I am start from the forehead. I don't feel no oil being put on my scalp. Are you are you squeezing it? Yeah, I'm squeezing it, Mom. Why your braid feel wet? I just washed my braids while I was in the shower. You hold a bottle. Okay. scalp look real healthy it looks seem to be only dry in the uh, the crown so we both greased each other's scalp and gave each other head massages and now we are ready to lay it down tomorrow is the last day we have our flight at two um yeah i want to do a little shopping on rodeo drive House of CB is literally right around the corner, like walking distance. I'm not going to walk though, but um, I definitely want to go in there because I've never been in that store. Um, so I want to go in there and do a little shopping before we head Tomorrow. to the airport. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then we're going to head on to the airport because I purposely um, left one side of my suitcase like 
with nothing in it so I could have room to add stuff because I knew that I was going to do a little shopping. So I will see you guys in the morning when we get ready to um, pack and yeah, I'm going to get up early and pack and then we're going to head over to Rodeo Drive and do a little shopping before we head to the airport. So good night. I'll see y'all in the morning. Today was a great day. Right, Pooh? Yeah. Good morning, good morning. Last day here. We are all hit, ready to head out. We are about to pop over to House of CB really quick. I don't think we're going to be able to go to Rodeo Drive, but we're coming back. So, because it's some stuff that um, ended up getting canceled. Not by me, but it's some stuff that you know, I was supposed to take care of on a mountain bike, bike ride. It ended up getting canceled because we were the only people to um, go at that time. So, another reason to come back to LA. So, we love it here so we'll just come back um and do rodeo rodeo drive then so but we are gonna go to house of cb before we head to the airport um and this is what i'm wearing karen is cute i look like a whole grandma over here you don't look like a grandma she got on her new sneakers that she um designed and her dress is Zara. And then she have on that little salmon hat that I got her. Um, just because it's, it's too much to pack in the suitcase. And then me, what I'm wearing is this Zara satin two-piece set. Comes with the jacket. No, I think it's separate. Yeah, it's separate. And then I just have on my Tory Burch slides with the Versace sports bra. So nice, cute cash um airport outfit because i'm telling y'all like i'm so serious i'm not wearing active wear anymore well i'm gonna try not to if it's not to the gym i'm so serious all right it says we three minutes away so it wasn't far at all it's like four minutes from the hotel rodeo drive not far either it's right around the corner somewhere but i really feel like it's not really a lot that i would want to get um, and if so, I would want to spend more time than like a few minutes. baby girl here we made it we did all that rushing and fussing and the flight be like but all that matters is we here in on time because i dropped the bags off before i rent uh return the car i felt like if i did it the other way around we wouldn't have been able to check our bags and the bags wouldn't have been on the flight with us so yeah and I ain't had time to fill the car up. But gas so high out here anyway. I feel like I got a deal by letting them do it. Cause the girl was like 84.19 and I'm like, she had gas five dollars a gallon here, so I feel like I saved. Cause I drove it all the way down to E. But she put me at like a quarter. So I had to fill it. So I only had to pay for like three quarters. for us yeah it's this one right here i just gotta find the ticket all right t that was an amazing trip huh okay yep yep we got us a little tan being out in the sun not too much not too much but we got us a little tan the car is fully charged yeah so now when we get home, we can put the other one on the charger. I ain't want to leave it on the charger the whole time we was gone. I'm not sure what. I'm not sure if it's safe or not, but yeah. Great trip. Had an amazing time. 
Now we head home. We ain't hungry, is you? Cause we done ate, we ate on the plane. Yeah. You are? No. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm sea walking. Yeah, I had a good time in, in LA. Like I had such a good time. It was such a vibe from the YouTube event all the way to the excursions. Me and Kyron had great bonding moments. Like it's so much to do in LA. Like I had no idea. The last time we went, I didn't know half of this stuff was available to do. Like everything that I did though, I'm definitely gonna leave in the description box for y'all to check out. Um, definitely check out bucketlisters.com um, for like, I mean, they, they do them everywhere. I, I know they have Seattle, they have DC, they have like a lot of different cities um, with like events and just excursions and things to do in different cities. That's how I found everything um, that we did on this trip from bucketlisters.com. You probably can find some of this stuff on Viator as well, but that's where I found everything. It's bucketlisters.com. Everything was a one-stop shop from the DIY sneakers to the boat ride to the water bikes, the mountain bikes. I mean, y'all didn't get to see us do that because they canceled on us, unfortunately. But like I said, it's a reason to go back. But I mean, the YouTube event, meeting the YouTube execs and networking with other YouTubers, I met a lot of great people. Um... It was very surprising to, to find out the people who watch me watch me. But learning that I do in fact have an impact on YouTube and um, YouTube execs know about me and watch me. That was definitely um, heartwarming and encouraging to keep going. Because you know sometimes I do feel a little discouraged. You know what I'm saying? But neither here nor there. This was a great, great trip. It was the, the vacation that I needed. Now we got to get back to work and get into editing these vlogs. I have two vlogs that I need to edit this week. So we gonna have two videos going up this week, which is good. I mean, I, I think I took a long enough break, um, knowing that I have work to do, you know what I'm saying? I couldn't take the whole month off. Um, I want to, but I can't cause I got work to do and life goes on you know what i'm saying so but i definitely took care of the things that i needed to take care of before i took this trip which was very important to me because i don't like tripping or you know vacationing when i have like things that i need to you know check off on my to-do list and stuff like that so that's all done and i ain't got to worry about that um and yeah just taking this break was just it was just what I needed. And y'all, we did damage in House of CB. I was not expecting it. That shopping experience is so luxurious. Um, what you see out on the floor isn't exactly what you're buying. That's just to try on. So it's it's like going into a bridal boutique. You know what I'm saying? Like you're trying on what's on the floor, but they actually pull you brand new items, which I was so like that really like warmed my heart right because i picked a lot of white items that i felt were kind of dingy and dirty and i was like damn i really don't want to buy these because you know what i'm saying i feel like i'm gonna have to put it in the cleaners but it's like that because i, I mean if y'all have shopped in house of cb before you can just close out of this section but that was my first time shopping in house of cb and i was not expecting it like the buy the the shopping process is just very luxurious like it gives Beverly Hills like they pull you brand new items from the back already like gift wraps it comes in this like amazing packaging one of my ribbons came off but like each dress comes in its own little package like that it's so nice y'all and like I said I did damage okay I went in there I would I thought I was gonna buy like one or two dresses Karen brought about two dresses and I bought like six or seven because every dress that I tried on looked amazing on me and I'm like oh my god when I was looking at the price tags I was like what but the quality is insane so yes if y'all have not been to la and done this stuff y'all need to go and do it la was a absolute vibe it's so much more than just eating and going to the clubs and partying like it's a lot to do long beach is beautiful malibu is beautiful beverly hills a vibe definitely stay at the sls i mean 
I enjoyed my stay. It's a little dark as far as the aesthetics, but it's a really, really nice hotel and it's kind of like smack dab in the middle of everything. California is big as hell, so definitely take into consideration like the time it's going to take to get from point A to point B because the traffic is crazy, even at night, even on Sundays. But the trip, so worth it. From the time we landed to the time we left, so worth it. I love LA. To live in mm, LA is the place to be. You know it. Everybody wanna see you. Hey Siri, play Tupac to live and die in LA. Now playing to live and die in LA by Tupac on Apple Music. Oh. 